Hey you guys! Okay, so I'm really excited. Um, I went to the Max store. Well, not really. I went to Macy's yesterday. I went to the Mac counter and I got some really pretty matte satin colors. I got um, Girly. It's really pretty. It's like a warm, it's like a warm pink. And then I got Swiss chocolate, which a lot, which a lot of you guys have seen already, but it's a really, really pretty brown. And then I got vanilla, which is a favorite anyway. It's got a little tiny, tiny bit of shimmer to it. It's really pretty. And I also picked up from the Benefit counter um, their new Sable Coal Eye Pencil. Sable is the color. And it's just, it's a brown. I don't know if you guys can see it. And then it comes with a sponge on the other end um, to smooth it in. So I'm going to play around with these colors today and make kind of a warm, wintry look, hopefully, that you can just wear on a day-to-day -day basis. I'm going to start out with Bare Steady Paint Pot, but you can use anything you want as a uh, as a base. And I washed my hands already, so I'm going to put it right on my lids. Okay. Next, I'm going to go in with my girly. I'm going to take my um, 239 brush. It's a little flat one, and it's good for supplying color, but I don't want it to be too dark because it's a warm. I don't want it to be too, you know, completely covered. Just going to put it all over my lid. I just packed it on. Super, super calm pink. I really like this color a lot. It took me forever to pick out colors in the store. I was driving the girl crazy. I, was like, I want it to be good. I want it to be good. If you're gonna spend money. And these are really good, I think, for pale skin. I tried them out yesterday when I got home and I was like, wow. It's really fun. So um, now I'm gonna do my highlight with vanilla. And I'm going in with my 213 brush, but Anything that you want to use for your highlight works. And then I'm going to go in with um, the Swiss chocolate. So bear with me. So I'm just highlighting it, lightening it up there. I'm going to take my um, 224 brush with my Swiss chocolate. Doo, doo, doo. Really, it, it like looks like there's nothing on the brush. But I'm going to flick it off anyway, and you'll see when I start in my corner, it definitely starts to pick it up. And I'm just going to sweep it over from the end. I think any warm color combination would work um, for just this season and for this exact like application. This is what I do on days when I'm wanting a quick, just like don't want to choose my colors. I'm really pale so I have to be careful anyway so I can't do anything too dramatic. Um, but this is warm and, um, and not overpowering I think. And it's a matte color so um, I have shimmer a little bit of shimmer on my cheeks and I have more of a glow, but um, my eyes are going to be pretty mellow today. It's just a mellow look. So, and I am, you know, putting it up in my crease pretty well here, because I definitely want that definition. And now I'm just going to go in and blend. No more color on the brush. Just that same amount is good. Kind of a, it's definitely Swiss chocolate in there. Okay, so now I'm just gonna take my um, that 239 brush again and put a little bit of Swiss chocolate on the tip like that. And just go under 
make a continuation of that color. Okay. Awesome. And now I'm going to grab another brush real fast. Any small tiny one will do. Um, I've got the 219. It's just a little tiny, tiny one. I'm going to go in with my vanilla and put it on the inner corner of my eye. Lighten it up a little bit more. And have it bring, drag it up into so that it um, follows my natural arch of my eyebrow a little bit. goes up to continue on on the brow bone. for a little extra zippy zazz in the corner. The light will hit it and it should look pretty. Okay. Now I'm going to go in with my Sable Benefit pencil. Really warm brown but not, you know, not too dark and not too light. I'm going to start in the middle drag it out, and I'm starting with a really, really fine point. So whatever pencil you're using, make sure you sharpen it really, really well. Oop! Messed up a little bit there. I'm going to go from the inside. I'm, I'm actually bringing it pretty high above my lid, or my um, eyelash line, I'm sorry, because I'm going to color it in afterwards, but I want it to be um, I want it to be pretty good eyeliner today, even though it's a warm, soft, calm look. Um, I'm in an eyeliner mood. And Renata, if you watch this, this is for you, baby. Okay. So, I'll do the other eye. Don't worry, I will go in and do my bottoms. inside to my eye. Okay. Just doing the um, outer half of my waterline. And, um, oh, my smudger. Is that the right one? Okay. Um, okay, so... I'm going to go in with my, um, my blender brush again and just do a little bit more blending here. Okay. Hey again, you guys. Sorry about that. Um, my doorbell rang. Everything's going crazy. Okay. I'm going to go in now with telescopic brown, any brown uh, mascara. And if you want to use falsies, you would probably put them on right now. I'm still practicing those. I can't quite get them on quickly, and so I don't think I should do a tutorial because I don't know really how to do it. Um, <laughs> but uh, if you know of any good videos that teach you, or if you make one, please send it to me. I've watched like four already, and I still it's still not helping. You know how there are just certain things that you just can't do, or it takes a while. Okay. I hope you like it. Merry Christmas, if I don't make another video. Oh, and I started doing my eyebrows different. I'm going to make a video about those too. But 